Hello friends, welcome back to Mila Educations. In today's video, we are going to talk about how to monitor AWS backups. So as you already know by now that there is no direct way of monitoring AWS backups for the jobs being completed, failed, started or stopped or anything that is happening with the backup jobs. And that's one of the major concern for almost all backup administrators, whoever are using AWS backup, native backup services from Amazon. All right, so let's get started. Guys, first thing first, if you're looking for just monitoring the backup jobs and their status, the very simplest and easiest way is use CloudWatch. Yes, you heard it rightly. CloudWatch is going to be the answer for you. Okay, so let's see how CloudWatch can help you to monitor AWS backup jobs. From the AWS services page, just try to navigate AWS CloudWatch. If you don't see this in recently visited section, you can just simply type in there CloudWatch and navigate from here. And here we are on the CloudWatch page. In CloudWatch page, uh, once you are landed here at CloudWatch page, please just scroll down a little bit and look for this event section. Under this event section, just click on rules and click on create rules. Once you are landed here in the services type, just select backup. And if you are not particular about uh, what kind of jobs you are going to monitor, if you want to monitor all the uh, success and failures and all the backup related events, just select all events in the event type section. If you want to kind of be selective that you just want to uh, monitor the backup plan state change or backup job state change or copy job state change. So you can particularly select those things and accordingly your JSON document uh, you know, uh, will, will get changed. But I would recommend to go ahead with all events if you do not have any particular requirements. As long as uh, you are starting it and uh, once you get familiar with the events and uh, the jobs you are monitoring, then after you can uh, come across to know like what else you may need or what else you may not need. So based on your experience of getting the alerts and the type of alerts, you can further modify it. But to start with, to test uh, your uh, backup infrastructure, if it is working properly for monitoring backup jobs or not, I would highly recommend to go ahead with all events. All right, so let's say all events. And then you have to set a target. So the target is going to be your SNS topic, the SNS topic uh, contains the email sending notification. So just add a target here and say SNS topic. And in, in SNS topic, I have already created a SNS topic that is known as backup monitoring. And there is a few email addresses linked to this backup monitoring SNS topic. So whenever the backup jobs are having any status change like started, completed, failed or whatever, I'm going to get a notification on this SNS topic and this SNS topic is going to send that notification back to the email addresses associated with this SNS topic, all right? So let's select this SNS topic and scroll down a bit and say configure details. Now you can uh, give any name here. So I'm just typing backup monitoring and that's it. Status, make sure it is enabled because if you mistakenly uncheck it, it's not going to work. This uh, rule is going to be disabled. It is not going to uh, send you any notification for that. All right, so make sure it is, the check is enabled here and then cl click on create rule. And that's it, you are done. After just few minutes, once you start any job uh, or once you perform any backup job operations, uh, you are going to get alerts for that. And don't be panic. Initially, you may see like lots of alerts for even a test backup job, but 
the intention for selecting all type of events that you are uh, going to receive is to understand the events type, select the event, event type that you may need in future, and then accordingly modify your uh, backup monitoring policy with the help of JSON documents. All right. Thank you very much and see you in the next video.